in this video series we're going to focus on 3JS and this is a 3JS tutorial and this is the first one which is what is 3JS and how can we quickly make something so what we're going to do here is straightforward first of all this little bit understanding what 3JS is and it is very interesting because 3JS is basically a way to create animations in 3D or 2D but it's it has the most practical application in 3D and draw them basically render them and create animations make it interactive this is as you can see here with all of these samples here it is really really interesting and you can go very very deep this will be probably quite huge and the, re the main reason for this is this is starting to support also virtual reality and augmented reality so there's a lot of things that we can do with it so this will be a series that we're going to start from very basics and then after, after we just keep on going more advanced first thing what I want you to do is here first of all we're going to create a very basic HTML file here you can see here what we have and what we're going to do here we're going to click on the documentation we're going to create here a first item you can see here a lot of this this I would say ignore this you can maybe maybe get this default uh, item as well I have the same one slightly different with these options here and the title and of course I just put in here the padding on zero and the margin on zero to normalize the CSS and what we're going to do first is probably add up here our 3JS library so to do this we go here to cdnjs.com search for 3JS and this is the latest version as of now I'm just going to copy this script tag here copy it all right and paste it in here there you are all right the next thing what I want to do is I want to grab a default option here in 3JS so we go here you can see here the the entire scene etc etc ignore this for now I will in the next video I will break it down one by one because it will be too complicated to experience to really read all of this long text here just scroll down to the very bottom here and grab this part here basically grab this entire item here just make sure you have your 3JS script as well if you already have everything the HTML and the body etc etc but you don't have this part just grab this part here this is the part that we're going to explore and dissect step by step before we go more in advance. So put it in here, paste this in here, and once you save this, we have this nice chunk of code. Refresh it, and now we have this nice cube here, a green cube for our basic 3JS. All right, we're going to explore in the next video what all of the code that we have so far added up here truly means.